I'd like to share a piece with you. I don't know what this piece is going to be about because this piece hasn't been written yet. It's floating in the ether somewhere. I'm just gonna pull a freestyle piece out of the air to see where it goes. And that'll actually be the title of the piece. Let's see where it goes. There is a moment when the soul begins to whisper and the soul begins to say and the soul begins to dream about being what it chooses to be. And in that moment it sees stitches in time written nine times. That means nine times the verse repeated and as the verse repeated all of a sudden its mission was completed. It was like the moment of conception and moving through the stages of pregnancy to be born. And I'm thinking about how sometimes you look into the eyes of people who walk down the street and their souls seem so worn. It seems as if they were lost in the midst of thought, lost in the midst of translation, lost in the midst of their imagination trying to lift them to a higher state of mind. And that's why sometimes we come to places where we can redeem the time. That means we look upon the clock that is upon our hand or look upon the lifelines that are upon our hand and wonder if we can become that woman or that man whose plan will come to reality. And I'm thinking about how sometimes we need to separate truth from fiction so that we can reshape our realities. And I'm thinking of this moment and how some people are walking in self-deprecating mentalities. That means they won't believe in their self. They won't believe in their dreams. They won't believe that life can be greater than it seems. And so in those moments, I think we should pause so we can see where it may go. Because sometimes we never know how simply waiting in the midst of the silence will stop us from committing emotional violence against ourselves. And I'm trying to help us understand that if we look into our eyes, we'll see our true selves. And we'll hear the bells begin to ring, we'll hear the bell begin to toll, and we'll hear the truth that was inside of our soul saying, you are, you can, you will be what you choose to be. So right now, be something greater than you ever imagined, even in the clearest picture of the dream you saw of your reality. And so right now, I want to bring it to this moment in time because I am nearly at the end of my rhyme. And so hopefully these two and a half minutes have been minutes that have been parting your mind from your soul and so you can realize that now is the time for some young people to grace this mic and remind us all how we were made in the image of pure gold and so in the next 10 seconds this verse will stop but in the next 10 seconds I hope that that clock will keep on ticking in your mind because right now it's time to realize that we were not left behind but it's time to see where this moment will go.